Hello, witches and magical kindreds. I'm Kim. Welcome to my channel, The Way of the Witch. Grab a cup of coffee, light a candle, and join me as I unbox the March 2023 Witch's Moon subscription box. This month, it's the Spell Crafter Collection. And a big thank you to the Witch's Moon for sending this box. This box in the U.S. runs $55 inclusive of shipping. First thing out of the box is a personalized oracle reading. This is the Circles of Healing Affirmation Deck by Alana Fairchild. This Elementary Calling Book of Shadows artwork. Next up, the Book of Shadows artwork, Enchanting the Stone, Clearing and Charging, The Gifts of the Stone and Earth, Stones Manifest, Energize of the Alchemical Birth. And this Days of the Week Correspondence Book of Shadows artwork, it's beautiful. I love the illustrations on this. Next, this extra large wild lavender purple sage bundle. It smells so good. It's really, really nice. I could see that it would be easy to just break off pieces and put it in a burn bowl if you don't have the space to light something this big because I, I'm guessing it gets pretty smoky. It's beautiful. I love it. Next, this hand-rolled green beeswax spell candle. I love their candles. I love to open them up a little bit and add some of the herbs that were sent in the box. It's beautiful. And next up, some herb packets from, well, some crystal quartz uh, shards. Really cool. I've never received that uh, from the Witch's Moon. Also some chaste berry, some licorice root, and uh, fire incense. Cool. These look really great for spell casting. Oh, and water herbs. Wonderful. Next, a bag of sea salt and a um, bath salts, Lady Luck. Lady Luck Ritual Sacred Salt associated with the essence and energies of luck. This unique blend was created with the intention of enhancing your ability to attract opportunities to your path. It smells really good. And here's a two-parter, a wood incense holder. 
and some patchouli ritual incense sticks. I love patchouli. I really, really do. So I'm going to go ahead and light this up. Next, the Manifest Ritual Aura Spray with oils of clove, cedarwood, palo santo, five finger grass, and a special mixture of our So Mode It Be Magical Oil. I love their sprays. And the stone of the month, green aventurine stone. Allow this beautiful stone to accompany you while you foster hope, optimism, and joy in your daily rituals and spell crafting. Yes, yes, yes. In fact, that is the manifestation spell that I'm working on this weekend. And finally, the Wikipedia Spell Deck, a compendium of 100 spells and rituals for the modern day witch by Sean Robbins, Leanne Greenway, and Charity Bedell. As you work with this collection of spell cards, take your time, be intentional, and feel inspired. The practices you will find within these cards were created to aid you on your quest to know the universe. Allow your guides and companions to accompany you on your journey, listening for their questions and gentle nudges. So let's have a little peek or preview of these cards. The deck comes with a fold out uh, info. It's, it's kind of like a little white book, but it's, you know, fold out. And this isn't really a tarot deck or an oracle deck, right? It's a spell deck. So essentially it's like a spell book, just in card form, I think. separated them into each of their categories and thought I would randomly choose from each pile and see what spell comes up so that we can have a preview of what this deck is all about. Big pile. Let's start with protection because it's here. 
The spell for protection, stopping difficult neighbors. The spell from the Sabbath's pile, Yuletide spell for peace. From the Pets in Nature pile, communicate with your pet. From the Spirituality pile, Heighten your instincts. From the money and career pile, get a mortgage. <laughs> From the love pile, a sweet notice me. From the family pile, oh, help with labor, okay. <laughs> From the self-care pile, beat the blues. From the healing pile, healing light. And finally, from the Cleanse and Purify pile, cleanse your chakras. What a great little spell deck. I could see that I, I could use this on occasion. I hope you enjoyed this Witch's Moon unboxing. I really like everything in this box. I think it was a, a really good box and I will use these items. What was your favorite thing? See you next time. Bye. <laughs>